Hey guys, it's Fiery Red Hero 8, and welcome to my side project that I'm introducing a little earlier than planned, but I'm still happy to be doing it. We're gonna play Super Mario Bros. 2. I haven't seen a lot of people actually play this game, at least in my circle on YouTube. Um, not just EC4, but other people that I talk to regularly. Um, besides Tim, I know he did this back in 2011. When Mario opened a door after climbing a long stair in his dream, another world spread before him and he heard a voice call for help to be freed from a spell. After awakening, Mario went to a cave nearby and to his surprise, he saw exactly what he saw in his dream. Push start. Very epic story right there. Like, best story ever. Okay, uh, quick explanation. Mario is balanced, speed and pickup. Luigi, high jump, but very kind of slow about picking stuff up. Toad, short jump, very, very quick. Uh, Peach can float, but she is the slowest at picking stuff up. And by picking stuff up, you'll see what I'm talking about. Um, but let's, let's play with the princess a little bit. I mean, I might just mix this up a little bit. I know Toad is the best character, but still. Oh my god, I love this area. But that's more or less what I mean by picking stuff up. She's very slow. But this is a very cool mechanic that they introduced. It's not even really introduced, because this was actually Doki Doki Panic when it came to the uh, the U.S. This was Super Mario Bros. 2, because the original Super Mario Bros. 2 in Japan was considered too hard. And for anybody that doesn't know, usually I think, um, well, I think you have to knock out three, uh, th three enemies with one vegetable in order to get a heart, but... You also want to look for orange potions and put it nearby and then you get a mushroom, mushy steroids, and coins. Coins are used for lives at the end of each um, level. And uh, But th that area is actually called the subcom, which is supposed to be just a play off of the subconscious because, you know, more or less this is just supposed to be all in Mario's head for some of those of you that don't know. Big spoilers. But, you know, it's pretty good plot twist for early in the game or for, you know, way back when in NES when they didn't really have a whole lot of story. Well, they had sometimes did. But I do like Peach because of her floating ability. I'll take that. But yeah, this is a very unique game, but it, it was called Doki Doki Panic and they but they put Mario characters on this title and released it to the US as Super Mario Brothers 2 because the lost levels, which was the real Super Mario Brothers 2 for Japan, they considered to be too hard. So that's what they did, and either way, I still think it was a, you know, it's a good title. Um, and of course, with the All-Stars version, they really made it colorful. I mean, this would be, quote, an HD remake upon their standards back then. And we're going to actually, instead of climbing up the clouds, we're going to go across the waterfall. And just so you know, you won't fall back down there, you'll actually fall to your death. And I'm not going to be mean, I'm going to be merciful. Hey, well, fine, I won't be merciful have a bomb. Actually so mean, aren't I? That actually gave us what we needed, so. Actually, no, I'm not, I'm gonna, I'm gonna let you sit down there, but I'm not gonna, no, I'm not gonna be mean. Not doing it. Epic boss music. And we're gonna see the most evil, evil boss in this entire game. Bruno! Because she shoots pure protein out at you. Oh god, that sounded way worse than it needed to be. Oh my god. Totally not what I meant. I mean, you can you can eat what she shoots at you for breakfast. Oh man, for a second I thought I was gonna die. Three hits, and then the magic crystal of life gets you to the next level. But the coins you play here, like you play the slots. Let's go to Atlantic City. Oh my god, yes! No freaking way, I've never done that in my life. Never do it again either. That was awesome. I'm just saying, okay? Never seen that happen before. Yeah. Ugh. I'm probably just, I mean, it depends on how much I get done in this. I'm just going to play for as long as I feel like, but I'm going to attempt to beat this game, which it's not impossible. It's not even that hard, to be honest with you. But it will be frustrating later on, so I'm not perfect at this game. I'm not really good at a lot of the platforming games of the age, but... But we'll see what I can do. Some of these pipes you can actually go down in some places and warp, but not this one. But I'll take this and I'll take that. And I could get a cherry, but I ran out of time. Damn it. Gosh darn it. 
I'm just having too much fun with this. We need to go down here. Grab the key. And obviously there's, there's like that guy. He'll chase after you. And he's in more than one area. And whenever you want him to just stop, you throw it down and he'll go away. However, he, he did hit me there. So um, I'll take that. And I'll do this. And there we go. This next part kind of sucks though. Because, whoa! Because of that. Because it, it's hard to get through here. Oh, man, I died. <laughs> I told you, I'm not good at this game. But it's so fun. There's that spring jump I just did, which I didn't explain that. But if you go like this, wait till he, she, jump, she jumps way higher. And all the characters do that, so. And you're annoying me. You want to get him out of there, at least. But the jumps are kind of quirky in the sense that... Um, like, sometimes you can't get through small gaps that you think you would get to. And I'm trying to get the hell out of the way here because I really don't... And sometimes you can fall off the ladders, too. There's just so much I'm trying to talk about. But it does feel good to record this. And I can't get through that gap. Are you serious? And that's not what I wanted. But we'll see if this actually... Cool. Because that'll give us another mushy. It feels good to record though because this week has really been stressful and this will be posted on Friday and thank God it is Friday. I'm telling you right now. It, it just, oh my God, it's so, this week has just not been the best week for me and I'm so glad to have the weekend. I'm saying. I mean, oh shit, what am I doing back here? Oh yeah, there's another potion and I want to take it but I forget where I need to take it. Maybe it's right here. Probably not, to be honest, but we'll see. Nope. I don't know where all of the locations are, and I'm not going to pretend that I do. So, this is just a run, you know? It's just a regular casual run, which is pretty much pretty. That's pretty much what my channel has come to. I mean, I used to try to go all out in 100% games, and I do. I'm happy that I accomplished those, but you know what? I'm just going to have fun. That's what I'm doing. Oh, uh, yeah. Hey, I'll take that. I'll take the lows. Let's see what I can get. Oh, two up. Woo! All right. I'll take it. I need the lives, trust me. Get a life. I do have a life. I've got plenty. All because of the controller in my hand. Woo! <laughs> but I do hope you guys will, um... I know I should be saving this for the end of the episode, but when have I ever waited to say things that I wanted to say? Um... But I hope you guys will join me tomorrow night on my Twitch to play Super Mario Galaxy 2. It's going to be fun. It's going to be real. It's going to be fun. Real fun. Oh god, you guys can tell. I am like wired out on caffeine and I am tired and it's like, holy crap. Is there another? You know what? There was probably another one here. Oh, the clock! The stopwatch. That is definitely a good, good item to have. That fish looks weird. Is there another one here? Nope, but I'll take the coins. I don't care. Oh, I could get the last one. Whoa, that was a big jump. Whoa! See, that's what I love about Peach's float ability. She can just, like, totally dodge a bunch of crap, even though she's pretty slow. Something also that's, um, similar to- or very, um, unique to this game is that there are only three levels to beat. Uh, well, except for the last world, there's only two levels on the very last world because they're super long. But in regular worlds, worlds one through six, I believe, is when, because there are only seven worlds too in this game. Whoa! Damn it. I totally don't mean that. Ugh. Yeah, grabbing the, the ladders in this game is a bitch, I'm not going to lie. It really is. Ugh. See, I didn't even push back there and it did and it did that to me. Okay. <laughs> this is really awful. But you only play... There's three levels in a regular world. Yeah. Let's just you do that. Okay. Now. I only need one to get up here. And then we're going to go this way since apparently ladders are my freaking bane. Come on, Peach. Show them you're smart. You're not just a silly blonde. Again, no offense to anybody who's blonde. I'm just messing around. I mean, technically, if you really want to, you know, mess with me here, <coughs> some random dude fourth. 
I am technically a strawberry blonde, so I like to consider myself still a redhead. Or at least, alright, alright, I'll, I'll give you this. I have the fiery temper of a redhead, but I do have blonde moments, okay? I'm not above that, but I'm still a redhead, so shut up. Just saying, um, okay, let's defeat that, and then I believe the door is back over here, so we're good. And this boss isn't too- oh my god. Oh, could I at least have just landed on the spikes? I'm telling you, like, I, I swear, the platforming isn't that bad, I'm just stupid. So I'm just gonna take it slow. There we go. I actually want to get that, but, well, do I even bother? Not really. I just wait for him. Okay. It's only the first world, and I'm already, like, screwing up so bad. What's cool, though, is, I mean, the bosses are actually pretty unique. And it looks like Legos. Cool. But this guy is Mauser. And this isn't the first, the last time you're going to see him either, because he actually is in the world, he's the world three boss too, which they must have been either strapped for time, or I think they might have had another boss at one point, or maybe Triclive was supposed to make a second appearance. But that's the boss for world two. Oh, come on, dude. But very simple. I used to freak out about this boss. Wow. I thought that I only hit him twice, not three times. Am I, am I just blind? I have no idea. Okay, whatever. Whatever. Oh, come on, dude. I was b I was doing so well. Pfft, okay, fine, whatever. I don't care. Let's see, what do we got? What do we got? What do we got? Nothing. Damn it. Pfft, shit. One more time. Eh, eh, eh. <laughs> I keep getting two, but the first one's always the one that screws up. Alright, guys, that was uh, World 1. And I know it's a short video, but I'm going to... It's 12 minutes. It's not bad. I'll see you guys in World 2. Peace out.